We're going to draw this angry Mewtwo. You start with the dome of the head, which is just going to be slightly curved. From there, we're going to come up with the ears. We're not going to cap them off. And you'll, oh, you'll see why later. Now the face and head, his head is tipped down and it, it's very angular, almost skeletal. All right, the forehead and then it dips in where the eyes are and then it dips in where the cheeks are. This is the only scientifically designed Pokemon. We're going to start just to the right of the middle of the head, come down, and come out this way with a V. These are very angry Mewtwo eyebrows. And under there, we're placing a U. And there are just two holes for the nose and a very small mouth. Coming out from the cheeks, I'm going to make a rectangle, but it's going to be oddly shaped. It's going to be slightly curved. These sides are going to come in towards the body. Now the bottom, we're going to go across, we're going to dip up, we're going to come up that far, right there, and over. Those are the pecs. From there, the body, a straight line, and then start to flare. Okay, let's come out thin from the shoulders and get thicker where there is some muscle mass. As we get to the elbow, we're going to make that kind of hardened. And then we're going to curve out and give him some muscle in the forearm and then those hands. We're curving out. There are two fingers. They are circular in shape. Two fingers and an opposing thumb. So there's one circle to make a loop and here is the thumb. I will do the same thing on this side. the waist, we're going to make an oval. And it's going to be a long vertical one. We're going to stop it right there. Continue here. And when we get to this point, I'm bringing that oval over here. At the waist, we're going to start out with the hips. We're coming out with a big curve. It's actually going to look like a chicken leg. There's the knee. Okay, now we're going to curve in. This is the lower part of the leg. There's a circle here. I don't know if that's a heel bone. We'll curve inward for the arch, flatten the bottom, and make a round toe. Same thing, second toe. Flat on the bottom. And then curve it back up and meet there. Same thing over here. Tail. It's going to continue from this area on the stomach and it's going to curve up from all the way up, loop and come back down. As we get to the end, it gets like thicker like a paddle. Then thins out again and then it runs parallel to about this point where it begins to thicken and back to the body. Now with a thinner marker I am going to make two curved lines. This is a stylistic Mewtwo so anything goes. Inside the eyes. I'm going to start with our purple. 
and I'm going to use a medium purple for the eyes, a dark purple for the stomach, the tail, and a pale purple for the remainder of the body. Here you are, our Mew 2. Okay, I hope you're happy with your drawing. I'll see you next time.